chase our need. No chase our need. No chase our need. No chase our need. Back to another episode of Kanyak Boys. Today, uh, y'all already know me. I'm comedian Fredo Davis. I keep saying it a million times till I don't have to say it no more. Mm-hmm. But we here for some very special guests today. Uh, tell them your name, Ron. How the hell you gonna say tell your name Ron? <laughs> tell your name Ron. Okay, my name is Ron. And he's a cognac boy too. <laughs> what else you want me to say? The the uh the the end tag, cognac boys, we talk the best ish. Goodness gracious. We here with the damn podcast, ladies and gentlemen. Y'all we'll add an applause later, don't worry about it. People gonna love you. Hey, but look, this is the damn podcast. It's two parts, but it's three of them. The other guy's late. Is um, maybe I could hit a pothole or some shit like that, mistake, as we should say. But he'll be here momentarily. Meanwhile, we got the lovely Jazz Segura of the Dan's podcast and your boy QB of the Dan podcast. And, and that empty chair is where KT will be. Keon Taylor, the man of many talents and the pool parties and the white all white yacht parties and the Ladies buffets and the chef and the person. <laughs> the beer gang member. Yeah, beer Curse gang. I forgot yeah, about that. He bought the cups. He bought the beer gang cups. Yeah, I had to loop, glue all the loose hairs on, from King the barbershop Nola. floor on my face. King, King Nola. Nola. Courtesy of Nola. Courtesy of King, King Nola. Nola. <laughs> Courtesy of New Orleans <laughs> brand <laughs> ambassador. You know what I'm saying? So, 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 so what? The, what the name? What the name? The Den come from? Where y'all come up with that? It's metaphoric. It's like a vibe. It's okay. like where we from in New Orleans, everything goes down in a den. Once you wind down from the dead, if it was a family meeting, if it was a cigar with a little cognac, no, sipping okay. with the granddaddies and the what? uncles or whatever, you know, that's what we do. You wind down and nothing is off limits in the den. That's where you release. That's where you chill. So it's your so, virginity. So that's why. <laughs> <laughs> that too. <laughs> that too. <laughs> so that's why oh, we yeah. call it the den because we don't want to be boxed into one genre of speaking on okay. our podcast. It goes down in the den. The den. Not the den. The den. The den. <laughs> brother, brother QB, uh, what would you be bringing to the den podcast? I would be bringing, I, I think I think KT and Jazz, they're going to be bringing more of the comedian side, you know, the, 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 hype, the hype side of it. I don't know, was that funny? You're, you're that funny. I promise. He asked you about Trudeau. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just messing around. No, um, pretty much I'm gonna be um, bringing the same energy that everybody else is going on. I'm gonna be bringing the same energy. It's, it's gonna be off limits when we talk about man. Yeah. You know, it's gonna really be off limits. Guns are blazing. Yeah. He's the more structured one though. He's the more. I don't think you always have the same energy, but then out of nowhere, it's Come like, on. you really be acting like a cr- cross the river dude, you know? <laughs> it's it was question. a West Bank it's still thing. It's a question if he's really from Nola. I'll <laughs> wait for my partner in crime to get here <laughs> so we can double team, bye-bye. <laughs> Third wall parkway, you heard me? Nah, I don't know about that. Did you just park? Okay, yeah. I don't know about that. Right on time. Yeah, so I don't know. think he's going to give the same energy, y'all. Who that? He's more of our uh, structured di- discipline, Onk. <laughs> yeah, that's my oh, nickname on the show. On the show Onk. He's the seasoned oh, yeah. wisdom Onk. guy. Yeah, you gotta have that Hit y'all with the cough when y'all yeah. saying it, brother. <laughs> yeah. 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 Check yourself, Q. Uh, right. He always has positive uh, energy. Like, uh, it's so good to be around him. One thing you gonna do is speak into your life. And that's how, it, is. That's how it really comes about, us coming together. Because Q was like, this is what's needed. We're gonna bring, you know. Family together. Yeah, okay. So y'all ain't none of y'all ain't blood relation. Not at all. Not at all. Mm-hmm. Man. We're, we're brothers and sisters. Family through Christ. Through another man. And through our family through another through Christ. man. <laughs> and I go. Bleed black and go. <laughs> right. Well. <laughs> I know you lying. See, this right here. Artists. What? Yeah, I'm, I'm a Chiefs fan, so See? it's that's, that's why you're questionable. Oh, love. He's really yeah, I'm, you know, I'm 30 years, man. You've been to the New Orleans parties, KT, you thought of courtesy in New Orleans? Yes, I do. With my Chiefs. So you're in New Orleans. Well, yeah, yeah. You know that that's funny when you got the accent of New Orleans. What do you call it, New Orleans? What do you call it? No, New Orleans. But sure. What do you call the people of New Orleans? What do you mean? The word. Like when you're a New Orleans. Oh, well, New Orleans. You know what I mean. <laughs> but you got the accent and then yeah. you got on the Okay, Cajun Creole. Outfit. Yeah, yeah. That's hey, a couple of my partners. We spice. We spice. A couple of my <laughs> partners <laughs> from <laughs> here. A couple of my <laughs> partners <laughs> from <laughs> here. <laughs> they they are Saints fans, though. So. They love you. They're they, from here. They from here and they Saints fans. No, I, I, I mean, everybody want to be a Saints fan. Right, I'm right. a Saints fan too. I like the Saints. I just don't like football. Though. 
Yeah, but I mean, when the Falcons lose, I like the same. But when the Falcons lose so much, you know, and be up 20, 20, 20 up. 
closest to the family. I mean, an uh, so apartment complex is no safe place for a superstar. That's yeah, no, no, okay. Don't, don't, don't judge about where it happened. <laughs> hey, I'm telling Let's you. Let's talk about her no. loss, the family loss, and what happened. It was unfortunate, but we're not going to judge because they have some nice apartments, nice condos, and stuff like that that people visit <clears> all the time. So let's not downplay where the girl lived and all that. No, she stayed in a nice apartment kind of thing. Nah, like, nah, he, nah. wasn't, he wasn't in. I'd have been in some ragged ass apartment kind of things. Yeah. But well, you feel like you got to bring up. Oh, I ain't saying I ain't saying it ragged, no. but but allegedly well, the dude was nice. The dude was nice pretty apartment. much basically the dude lived there. Huh? Well, yeah, that's what I heard. He lived there. He was gone then, for like a week. Though, yeah, right? you going for a week. He's a truck driver, right? Yeah, I don't know where he is. Walk walk. Yeah. Road. I'll be back. But I damn sure ain't going to sleep over no chick house like that. Oh, no, yeah. yeah. That's nah, when, when look we, at, we, I wouldn't even really go. He he just, it's, it's, saying it's, def, it's definitely somebody he's been with for a minute, yeah. obviously, he's that he was comfortable with, with you know what I mean? A trust but factor. after a week, mm-hmm. dude leaving the crib, you know what I mean? I think that part was reckless on reckless, both parts. Yes. You know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. There's a lot of allegedly yeah. going on. That's why women shouldn't move on so fast. Oh, oh, go, go to the other dude. Go to the dude houses. Go somewhere else. You know what I'm saying? Go yeah, to the hotel real. room. All these so, motel sixes. She couldn't go to the house. Hey, look, that stuff happening. I have a lot of stuff. Yes, size yeah, size real size 12 is at the crib. You walk in there. Damn, your, your feet big as hell. That's yeah, what I'm, I don't take my shoes yeah. off and leave I have a garage and I had applied it many times of allowing them to park in the garage to hide the car. But you know, sometimes you got to use your discernment and be in tune with your spirit that say, no, baby, I'm coming by you. Mm. Yeah. You just gotta think about it, cause guess what? Garage or not, and no matter how you try to not answer that door, them niggas be lurking. So and, and, and just and go somewhere else. Right, I was about to say, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 no, no, yeah. not yeah. good. Yeah. Not good. Yeah. Not good. Yeah. You got if the pussy boy. <laughs> but but listen, <laughs> then you walk in there, right? You walk in there. This is the, like a lot of people saying stuff. But I don't feel like they being real. Mm-hmm. This your girl, y'all ain't got into it. A week later, you come in the house and she laying in the bed with another dude. I'm like going that. off too. A lot of dudes, a lot of dudes gonna go off. Like I you know, would, I like, would but fight probably, you, but probably, you got a pistol. But I'm saying it, that it's not being said right now. But I'm sure trouble name came up. Like he knew oh, about yeah. him. Hell yeah. He yeah. knew she was fucking him. Man. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that I'm nice sure ass car popped out in front of this trash ass apartment. Yeah, he ain't like he. <laughs> <ooh, laughs> <yeah. laughs> I gotta keep downplaying the apartment, you know? yeah. My nigga got locked up. See, you should have Ubered there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That'll keep your love safe. Shit, but but you know, I already know how it is though with the, with the chick. You know what I'm saying? The dude, the, the so called ex boyfriend. She, she's selling him woke tickets too. It ain't all the way over. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? She know, she know it. All right, she she was like, cause trouble was on her. He wanted to be a rapper too. He yeah. probably was. Well, he was, uh, uh, he was a, a truck rapper. A truck rapper. When, 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 when he was breaking was, in the, the was, door, he heard her right? making her back yeah, blow out. Like, that was that guy been in the crazy. So they had to know each other. He from Jonesboro. No, that Come on, man. You know who the fuck trouble is. No, that nigga from Virginia. They killed him. He's from Virginia. Get the fuck out of here. That's what from Hold on. Let's bring this back. Now, that nigga from Jones Pro Project right there on the side. Let's keep it in those parts of me. I cannot afford no back collection. Mm mm. So so how long you think is <laughs> is a is a good time for a woman to move on? A woman or a man to move on. Like like that, like to the point where you calling somebody up to come to your crib. You get what I'm saying? What's a good a good window? I don't think oh. it's a time frame. I think it's a feeling. If you feel like you have a vibe or energy with somebody, whether I'm still in love with a person or not, if we're not together, I can go where I choose to go. I have to just be smart of how I move. Yeah, First that's of what all, you think, but on all behalf of all stalkers in our union, mm-hmm. <laughs> ain't look, 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 I'm in your trunk. The question right was, right. I'm, I'm in your question. I've got your frat door. Like, I'm listening. Time frame? Yeah, the okay, question the was question the time was the time frame. frame. For me, it's mm-hmm. no particular time. She can so, do it. All right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Next day? She's a man. No, I ain't saying that. I'm saying, but every little time. I think that's why. Tears ain't drying up. Yeah, why would I say the next day? You said it. I mean, mentally, mentally, yeah, I'll say three months. Three months? I say three months. Man, I don't give it no time. Three months. When I'm done with you, I'm done with you. No, I think because I'm through. I think women take longer. You know, sometimes. Don't believe that shit. This is hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. This well, I guess I don't, get like, I don't get out much. Allegedly, it's, it's a place where both of them live. <laughs> allegedly, this is a place where both of them live. Yeah. So if me and you lived in this place two, three years, six months, whatever, a week, I know for sure. It's too soon for it's anybody, soon. whether it's I, the dude stayed and she left, or the the girl stayed and the dude left. A yeah. week is too short to yeah. be allowing somebody else. She, she down right. If they, 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 they did live together, 
If well, they did, we feel okay for somebody to visit her or That's him, because sure women pull up and well, yeah, be I mean, stalking too. But they ain't gonna kill you. Shoot! If, if you ain't gave me my gave you ain't gave me my gave me real fast. It gotta be more to it than that. Like it's the, the dude felt that something was happening. Oh, yeah. 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 and, and, and then a, a dude to like him. come and catch it. Yeah. <laughs> And you've been selling it, <laughs> and probably she was denying it. Now, the all that, all that the smoke of fuel turned into a whole different you person. You got that right. Yeah. That's what you kicked the door. You 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 like I don't stupid think he kicked the door, though. The whole time. He, well, his key still works. Now, but definitely his key still works. That nigga still ain't here. You ain't even changed a lot. Because if you kick the door, and they still sleep. Y'all still yeah, together if the keys still work. Yeah, I feel yeah, like the, the neighbors told, look, when you ain't here, old boy be pulling up. Nah, the office? neighbors heard. You want me to offer the watch? The neighbors heard. The neighbors know his name. The neighbors know his name. Oh, so they did interview. No, nigga, he's stupid. You know that, nigga. All right, boo. Come on, catch up, boo. Come on. Catch up, boo. Catch up, boo. Catch up, boo. This nigga like, oh, for real, they interviewed. You see why he fit in the show. Hey, hey, hey have anybody, have anybody show ever got caught, caught in, to, in a woman house before? Say again. Like, yeah, have any of y'all ever been caught? When I was younger. Oh, the lady uh, too, you ever been caught in the situation you like. You been caught in mid-buck? You know what I'm saying? You ever been in well, type of shit like that? Well, caught plenty of at my house before, right. but I ain't never she got never caught. But he's so yeah, cool. I, I seen this guy in action. He's cool. Hey, man. Come hey, here where you come for and get your ass out of here now. I heard him crack his shotgun. He old school. No one needs to stay. I had to jump out the window one time. It was like three stories up. Yeah, it was a safe little landing, though. Yeah. And it was like this for a long time. time. Problem there, bro. Yeah, I never experienced both sides of the water. Now kind of no, I'm going down one level before I jump. But yeah, take it, whatever. I'm going down one level. Touch both nah, sides. I just jumped. She said, "He here, Spidey." Who is he? He here. Say it, old Spider Man. You hear the nigga? You hear the nigga footsteps? Dude, dude. Oh, yeah, he's a big nigga. Hey, man, but we. On a positive note, man, we appreciate y'all, and we want to say congratulations to y'all, too, for doing y'all thing. Thank y'all for taking the time out of stop Stop by, you know. I'll be on the road looking at y'all hacking the ass up in here, and I'm glad we had a plan, a a chance to get in this motherfucker and do our thing. Hey, man, we sharing our platform with you great bunch of people, man, so when y'all take off, y'all can come back and get the little people to help you start it, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people say they give you flowers. Why you can smell them, but we give you cocaine while you can snort it here. Okay. That's the Cognac Boys podcast. You right on the table. Speaking of cocaine while you can smell it, I, I had the pleasure of uh, producing my first comedy show for this guy. Comedy yeah. special, bro. Yes. 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 One hour comedy special. Yes. I was 15 oh, minutes. Thanks. JJ Vince. my favorite joke. Hey, man. <laughs> the breathing <laughs> joke. It, it was a oh, thing. Man. I can't wait to see, I can't wait to see the, uh, the outcome. The final, yeah, shout out to Flip. Flip oh, yeah. Production Flip, over Flip, Flip. Ugly Money Nietzsche's. Studio. Um, P. Nice. You know, yeah. P. Nice. P. Nice. Always P. Nice. Yeah, Philip Harris. Give us a place. Place. Yeah, us a place yeah, to make Yeah, how much money happen. you make? Yeah. P. Yes. Diddy. Yes. Hey, he's doing it. Because he's getting artists down there 20,000 hey, a month. He's doing it. He's doing it, man. Yeah, I salute yeah. him. And they're going, they going in those, those country towns and grabbing them boys that people yeah, you're don't get a chance to see. Yeah, he's supposed to. He make them battle it out. Yeah. And he's doing videos for them. Like, he got one stop production shop. Ugly Money Nietzsche, you on this great thing, boy. Shout out to him. We're going to bring him on the podcast. Fuck all that. Yeah, we should We're going to do it at his studio. Yeah, yeah. So we y'all gonna shoot y'all damn podcast in his studio? No, no, I'm saying when we go, oh, okay. we all just ask everything in here. We're going to put the Den podcast and the Kanye. You already got y'all pictures history. and stuff done? Yeah, we already. Who shot y'all pictures? Oh, man, it was some dude named uh, Fredo Davis. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we don't want to He's a photographer. Hey, man, I'm not going to stop shopping. I'm not going to stop shopping. Hey, man, I'm my cousin. Keep it in the family. Yeah. Every, one thing about us is all in the family. Yes. Everybody yeah. at this table. Got, like we do every stuff. <laughs> all in the family. Every we, stuff. We do, we do every stuff. Yeah. yeah. You know, you know the, the funniest thing that, that Steve Harvey said? He said, I am poor or I is rich. So you don't have to be correct all the time when you're saying everything. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I just wanted to leave I thought that. he was like had about to drop like yeah, a major, a, a major nugget, and he never <laughs> that shit ain't had to It do with just that. went like, hey, he dropped. He dropped one of them. Uh, them J. You know, replay. Replay. You know what Steve Harvey said? Replay. Them J. Prince. He hit them J. Prince. I don't want some Steve Harvey said that motivate me. That's what he gonna use. Hey, so he didn't finish. He didn't finish. Sorry, he didn't finish. Steve, Steve. you are 
and how many degrees you got, right. you is rich you is with your rich. uneducated ass. So right. who's smarter, the motherfucker with all them degrees or the motherfucker without the degrees with all the money? Right. Facts. Right. Thank you, brother. Right. You know why three of us, man? Hey, man. Two to articulate and one to... Red, I guess <laughs> blue fish, I'm about blue to fish. Yeah, the snow bus right here. Nickname Daddy Wet. No, he was down from up. Uptown. Shout out to Uptown Fantasy. Third one pop with you. Heard me? Yeah, yeah. Almost doesn't come. Almost made it doesn't come. He's still in pop, y'all. On the pop with. He's still in pop. So do me this favor. I want you to break down each which um each one of y'all be bringing to the damn podcast. Starting with you, Jazz. I did that. Right. I think it's sixteen times. No, no. I want to hear her right quick. I want to go and. Uh, unisex? What's that? No, no. Either I is rich or either I ain't. Is you is. Or but is I'm going to be rich. He won't go counterclockwise. Yeah, whatever that is. Um, no. I think basically just myself. Like, I'm no, no, you got to do I'm genuine. The people don't know you. I'm like genuine know. and I speak from both point of views. I feel like I'm always the girl that's proud of the victim blamer, like Deja Fell say. But and you a lot of girls feel like I'm. You, toxic. you gotta tuck that in. Hey, no, they need to know a, lot of, um, a lot of girls say that I'm always on the dude side. I just feel like I see it from Because you one of us. I'm not. They just cut I you like men. I'm submissive. Well, not submissive. That's not the word for me. But don't do that. Because I don't know about. If you got titties in a coochie, like you ain't one of us. Okay, what's up? Now nah, they cut hers off at birth. Uh, I'm nurturing. They should have never gave her a coochie. I'm all those things. But I don't have to submit because I naturally fall in alignment of what the order of a man and a female kill king and queen is. And how you supposed to so raise your family you. and all that. You so say what you want, baby. I, I come from rich niggas. soil. 3301 Olivia niggas. Davis, New Orleans, Black Ball, and Pride to QB. Shout out his little Davis, you're in your kidding me. You're some kidding to me? You're kidding to me. <laughs> Probably is. Uh, but no, I'm married. I'm married. I'm married. I used to be married. I was married for seven years. Yeah, that nigga got the hell out of there. Huh? Who left? You left. I left. You left. Yeah, I always choose me. It's always the woman that leaves. I always choose me. What was the original? Question I got caught right. up in. Yeah, 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 yeah. What you gonna be bringing to the damn podcast? <laughs> turning into Kevin Samuels. What I'm gonna be. <laughs> 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 I got it anyway, back to me. I got to be for the ladies. How much do you weigh? Uh, from health, lifestyle, hey man, beauty. Peace, Kevin Samuels, man. Long live Kevin Samuels. Kevin Samuels. Hey man, that brother used to be a. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. The first time, I, the first time I seen him, I was just like, "Who is this gay ass nigga with this dumb shit?" Yeah, but but then well, I, he had a point. He yeah. started having a point, but I still feel like he was gay as fuck. He took me in the mind to go. I ain't died. I can't even. I can't even bring the, the gay word up. I ain't died. So you know what I'm he kind of remind me of Goldie. Remember the pimp? Nigga? Uh, he he went, how did he die? They went out with a lady in the buck. A lot of dudes died from sex nowadays. This is crazy. Yeah, well, that's like that's that. a dangerous cuckoo, man. No, nah, man. It's God, what they it's taking it's before it's they do it. it. Oh, Red Bull. They trying to kill the coochie. Gold, Red Bull will fuck you up, too, but it's they it's got um natural the, 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 uh, the gorillas. The gorillas yeah. almost killed me one night. Yeah, I remember. Man, I had a nice little menage, and I had an extra. It was a lot of shit going on that I wanted to impress all of them. You know? <laughs> oh, I, ain't want, I ain't want my shit never to go down. It was one over here, it was one over there, it was one right here, and I was all of them. You know what I mean? Heart wouldn't go down. That man, Paul Hart. It looked like a whole bunch of black rubber balloons in that game. Again? Again? Put some more blood, nigga! Shit! No, all the blood was in my dick. That's what the problem was. This shit, the heart ain't had no blood. I couldn't think of nothing. I was lightheaded. If I go out, put my clothes back on. You know it's bad when you need something to drink bad, you reach for a honey. You know it's bad when you gotta take a die, die. <laughs> no, that was in my younger days. That was yeah, in my younger days. Yeah. Hey, the young boy, the young boy be taking goddamn all that shit now. Seamoss, Seamoss is good. Seamoss, right? Seamoss for that. But, that, <laughs> yeah, 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 but sometimes you don't want to last long. You know, you just want to get your little shit and get out of there. You but you want to satisfy all them, right? You? Oh, sometimes. sometimes. Fuck that. Horrible. I got shit to do. I guess I'm the worst person. I'm always trying to make sure they come first. But if we right. vibing, she should come back. You're a good man, my friend. He just yeah. feel like that was something vibing, to say. She come in a room, y'all, yeah. in a room yeah. full of y'all, he just felt like that was something to say. Yeah. Hey, it's a good thing. He's, he's, a <laughs> he's a married guy on the show, so he's always going to give all excellent kinds. marriage advice. Yeah. Yeah. That's what he brings. Yeah. We're going to see who that, got the most followers and who they like the most after this. Well, toxic always wins. I bring balance. Huh? Toxic always wins. Well, that's where I come in at. I'm the toxic motherfucker. Hey man, I just you always, you that you know, like toxic, you always win though. That. Yeah, speak, oh, yeah. speak on it, KT. Look at your toxic that. situations and relations and stuff that you oh, can man. indulge say on. Say that for the den. And let the people know. You ain't gotta say nothing. I'm gonna work your mind. 
Even when I'm a guest on your podcast, we're going on their podcast too. Hey, man. At the end of the day, up and out. At the end of the day, we just some kids from New Orleans speaking our truth about life through our lenses. So mm-hmm. ain't no conversation off limits. Ain't no subjects off limits. We're going to talk about whatever it is, whether it's funny, whether it's sad. We're going to laugh about it. Yeah, I want to see do. some tears and jerkers in there. Oh, it's gonna, it's gonna I know all you guys like for me, you know. But some yeah. tear jerkers in there. We got we about 30 talk. episodes if you talk about our personal individual right. life. Yeah, but keep your personal and entertainment separated, but you indulge and you change the names It's going to be all together. Protect the guilty. It's going to be all together. Because where we from, that's how we was raised. Most stuff that people wasn't introduced to at an early age, we were exposed to. You hear the accent people at home? You know. You heard me? We ain't, we ain't holding nothing, baby. We're going to be transparent. We're going to be no. I know we're going to be riding the public bus. bus hey, man, he, got good speaker. he got good speakers. You ain't got to keep doing this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he good like this. He's good. Yeah, he's good. Yeah, he's good. Excuse me. Uh, he, I heard you in the hallway, dog. You ain't got to do all that. <laughs> nah, but I was, I was six years old when I rode the bus by myself. Sit so. up straight. <laughs> We ain't running all that humping, man. Hey, he took off his Ninja Turtle <laughs> chair. He got to go back to work. Got hey, I forgot, I forgot to formally introduce you. I, I don't know if y'all know, ladies and gentlemen, but we got uh, a legend in the building. This is uh, No Limit Finest. You know what I mean? We, no we got to talk about soldier. We gotta, I thought we gotta, I told we, we, we gotta, you. We got we got a true tank up in here. Yeah, we got, we, got, we got a real No Limit Soldier. Uh, hey, Master P. Master P. It's badges over here. I want to have a sit down with your brother. He can make out. to your daughter. I lost a daughter before, so I know Rest how to go. Peace, but Rest right. in peace, miracle. When, 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 you, when you get to a place where you're ready to sit down and talk business, I really want to sit down with you, my mm-hmm. brother, and I salute everything you do. And we want to talk to Rick Ross because we got the new property out there. Eight gates down for Rick Ross. We want to talk about some things over there. Them. When you go back to the house, honk the horn. Oh, yeah, and I would just want to say this on the Den Podcast. Rick Ross, you ain't the only nigga in Fayetteville with money. I stayed two of those. <laughs> so eight gates down. down. Eight gates 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 down. Whenever you, whenever you got time, you can invite a nigga in. You know what I mean? Yeah. Or just come eight gates down to the events. That yeah, eight gates down, you'll see us the little house on the left. It look like one of them little two sheds. Shout out to Rick Brown, Home man. Depot. That brother had that big car show on my birthday, man. I, yeah, was, I yeah, wanted to up make traffic, man. Yeah, he fucked up the traffic, really. We ain't had no holes at the pool. I got park. excited, baby. <laughs> motherfucker was coming to my house. <laughs> <laughs> I said, oh, them bitches coming, boy. Them bitches lined up. We ain't no traffic on that water. I said, boy, what you put this on Instagram or something? He said, boy, they showed up. Boy, them motherfuckers showed up. Oh, man, they gone, huh? Man, traffic backed up down here. Like, yeah, that's how I do it, you hear me? That's how I do it, you hear me? Get him! They just make it all stop. Boy, what you not even coming from? Curtis Hill, New Orleans, nigga, you know they fuck with me? What you thought? Keep it bumping, boy. What you thought? Right past, looking at you, man. They're not fucking around, calling everybody. I thought you said you was up the street. Where you at? No, nigga, we was going by Ross. I just said, I was going to let you know we was in Fayetteville. Like, we, we hey, might stop fucking clean by. over, you know what I'm Yeah. With hey, friends like that, who need enemies? Hey, How you gonna come get a to-go play? You still got some of that? You still got some of that brunch shit? <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? That's, right. That's, That's how nigga is. That's how nigga is. That's how nigga is. Hey, we over here by Ross. I'm still. Gonna stop by you, and e. you still got some of that brunch shit over there. I seen all the pretty ass pictures you had on Instagram. Ross ain't got no food trucks out here. Nigga just got caught. <laughs> oh, that nigga that little <laughs> wing <laughs> stop. Nigga ain't even bring the wing stop out here. No, he ain't bring the wing stop truck out here. Nigga ain't bring no thighs, no nothing. God show me. Gotta pay for that. Oh, man. So, yeah, so you ain't finished saying what you was bringing to the damn podcast. I did. We gotta get cute. That's what you're gonna bring? That crazy shit? Yeah, that crazy shit. That whole shit. hour of power. I bring balance, man. You know, it's hard controlling these two. I'm I got mm-hmm. I gotta I gotta I gotta be, you know, she said she uh, 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 I'm the I gotta security, be security. Everything. Brother My everything. You know what I mean? <laughs> a, 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 a shoulder to lean on, a listening ear. And this brother right here. I'm I, just bring it straight home to it, man. Oh, you didn't care about the home. Okay. That's what it's about. Oh, you, oh, you buying it at home? 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 Hey, I need to tell my business advisor. Go ahead and on LLC that right quick, please. No limit. So we're not no limit QB. We just no limit. I'm just on. No limit on. Uncle QB. Uncle QB. I say Uncle QB. So you gonna bring the the knowledge, the knowledge without college. Everybody's on the show. Exactly. That's what's up. Without the college, yeah. Yeah. You jazz of all trades. When you do it with the college, jazz of all trades. That's gonna be your name. Jazz of all trades. That's a good name. No, my name is Jazz. I'm gonna be Mama Yankee. Just Jazz. Mama Yankee. 
Mama who? Mama Yeager. Well, Jazz of all I trades. That, that, that other so name. Cleo, you like, want to be a madman. <laughs> <laughs> right. She want to be a madman. That's that Mama new show. That's that new show. Mama Lace and Lace. Cleo. What's the new show on Netflix? From, from, from that was your auntie under the Super Bowl, huh? What's that show? The new show at um, Club Netflix. Pink? Everybody be talking about. Talking about Club Pink? Oh, um, no. Oh, yeah, she did. Pink Valley? What's that club? Pink Valley. I don't know. Third episode. Valley, something. Hey, Jazz, that wasn't your That wasn't your auntie under the Super Bowl. That wasn't your auntie under the Super Bowl. P-Valley. 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 P-Valley.
Yeah, yeah. Hey, and when and when he finally when, that when he do get that shit that that want to take it that, that yeah, step, oh. that's when the girl gonna come running back. But you still don't. They, they get jealous. Then. Oh, she might not. She, she might is. Not. Trust me. She ain't going back to nobody else, did she? But you say, <laughs> ain't, no, ain't nobody well, else. Well, I, would, I, would, I would go back. I would go back. For no, other no, 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 The way she moving, but she's think, not going back once he gets anybody. No, not going That's back. That's not how she moves. That's that white boy. She no, she right not. Up. Not back to him. Probably, I doubt she would. Niggas don't like when you pulling you on you and you move a certain way. Everybody has the freedom to make a choice of how they want to rock in their relationship. It's communication. We don't know what it is. I don't think he was speaking on that kind of comeback. Niggas come back, meaning she gonna come back for some dick eventually. Not. Oh, she might not. Not, not saying she coming back to the relationship. A, a she lot of girls pretend. Do that. So once they out, they don't have to pretend anymore. Okay. So she might not it even depends. go back for that. Hey. It depends. Any women out there. Like you always got to go back. Need a real Any women check. out there that, that ever pretended back. with me, DM me and let me know if he was, you know. Hey, look. That's why I was going to say this. I don't know if you pretended or not. I got 11 to 1 that says I can try again. On behalf of Laura Harvey and all the young ladies that follow her lead, uh, one man's trash is another man's treasure. You hear me? And it's still trash. <laughs> hey, hey, and I want my turn once I get up there, Lord. Yeah. Oh, that's cold. Let <laughs> that, me. That, that's that's real. Let, they can't shit on till I fuck. Like, let, you know, yeah, let I me. ain't never fucked, so I can't yeah, shit on. Let me, let me see what that shit is. I fuck, know. man. Yeah, I can be like, man, that whole garbage. Yeah, like, like, that's like, poop. That whole poop. <laughs> Even with the like the Sierra situation, right? Man, I, I, I been knew that whole with poop. <laughs> I tell that bitch, I got nothing. I been, I been knew you were poop. My nigga told me this shit. Woo! Yeah, here you go. I've been doing yeah, yeah, something garbage. to do. Bitch, my nigga told me this shit was hey, garbage. But some I, niggas love digging in that garbage, though. Uh, oh, yeah, Sierra was twerking now. Uh, again. Man, her skin oh, ass, man. She don't get her frill. All that ass in the frail. video. All that ass in the video, a nigga worrying about gas prices. I ain't never seen a woman <laughs> have kids and lose lose weight. Huh? She's she skinny. Mean? How you had two babies by Russell? They, they got different diets. Right, she she yeah. always messed yeah. up. Yeah, yeah, that always did. Huh? Who? I said Janet always did it. Janet, Janet ain't never had no kids. Man. But no, I'm saying Janet is not what I'm just saying. She always yeah. said Janet ain't never had no kids. Hey, Janet used Michael Michael. I'm Michael her number stop. one fan. I watched her whole career. <laughs> Janet ain't never had yeah, no kids. Yeah, he been kid. stalking her for a long time. Since she was playing Penny, since she was playing Penny, he was talking to since she was playing Penny. Hey man, Jermaine Dupree made me feel like I had a chance. Oh yeah, shit. Oh, she threw up on her. Oh, he threw up on her. Damn, a lot of niggas make me feel like I got a chance. Fuck. Hey, you do right place and right time. You can just a time. You can bag them. Yeah. It's always. Let it fall normally. Or fifth spot. I'm hoping I can run up on my. How woman? I don't care how faithful a woman claims she is. It's always about timing with her, man. True. I agree because somebody fucked my old lady, man. <laughs> hey, go to commercial. I gotta cry. <laughs> oh, man. My old lady ain't been the same. She left my hallway in her. And I just wanted to say, uh, nigga, nigga turned into a sewer hole. Uh, oh man, nigga turned into a tunnel. Somebody left a oh, pot hole in my old lady. <laughs> Man, where y'all at this week? Y'all got any shows this hey, week? Hey, man, we yeah, in the yeah. city. Wherever you at, we there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Henry, but Henry, we Henry, doing Henry, grown folks stuff, Henry man. Watch at Uptown. So we support Henry Watch at Uptown Comedy Corner. Ladies and gentlemen, you now in tune to the Kanye West Podcast. This is the Den Podcast. Y'all will see a lot the from them in the near future. Y'all know y'all got plans for a slate date um, when y'all going to drop? Um, we gotta talk to the mother of the group. Oh, now I'm the mother. She got the mother. I don't know who the fuck that is. We gotta do New York. Mother? Okay, Mama Yege. She's the mother. Go on, do that, man. Mama Yege, you got a. What you say? Jazz of Jazz of Many Talents? What is it? Jazz of all trades. Jazz of all trades. Jazz of all trades. Yeah, there you go. Jazz of all trades. Yeah, because she got a lot of trades. She got a lot of businesses, the snowball shit for the kids in the summertime. Shout out to Royal Culture, Royal Culture Snowball. Royal Culture Face Snowball. Face Forever Beauty. Face Forever Strip Beauty. Strip her lashes. Strip her lashes. Oh, you Jazzy put these big the dumb ass butterfly yeah, wings on these girls' face? Are you hey. doing that? We the stuff Bell Pepper. Oh, the stuff Bell Pepper. Oh, she's jumping. Jazzy Tastes Anola. We're going to be doing something. Yeah, she can cook when she wants to. We're going to do some classes on the podcast. It's going to be more than just sitting and talking. We're going to get y'all involved with your lifestyle. It's going to be the culture all around, baby. Well, you might want to take a tour of this nice place here because if you are going to do all of that cooking and all that stuff, you might want to take a tour of this nice place here because if you going to do all of that cooking and all that stuff, you might want to take a tour of this nice place here because if you going to do all of that cooking and all that stuff, you might want to take a tour of this nice place here because if you going to do all of that cooking and all that stuff, you might want to take a t
pre-cook your meals and then just bring it on the podcast. They, they always try to, to manage me. I keep telling y'all I'm going to put it in the microwave when we get here. Instructions. <laughs> <laughs> you don't understand. Like right? at home, microwave in here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Your eyelashes Thanks. look real natural, too. Thank you. Yeah, and that's what Strip we want to take it back to. Lashes. That's we want to take it back to natural. That's what 100% mink. That's all I'm saying. Fool me. Fool me. Fool me. Say it again. Say it again. Say it again. Fool me. No, say the other one. Oh, they look natural. Yeah. See that? That's good. See so that? do y'all use... I ain't hear nothing. So let me ask you this. And I got a vending machine okay. with lashes that I'm going to be putting. I'm getting money. You get yeah, it, I'm going to put it in. Right I'm going to be cut. dropping that on my Instagram. I know it look real dry, hey, but I got a vending machine that I'm going to be putting either in the mall or maybe one of these colleges. Big see. business. So do you use the half the barbershop floors? <laughs> 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 Why? Why are you like this? Is this ball sack here? Somebody else used that here. Is this ball sack here? No one that look real. You trying to spell it? Help me. All natural. It's all natural. Let's put it wrap, man. Let's put it wrap. Ball sack here. Thanks. 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 I'm coming out with a line for it. It's gonna be called this that nigga shit last. Why we had this weekend? Why do people need to pull up and hang out with us? Where we at? QB house. QB barbecuing. Oh, where? Yeah, he barbecue. Way out yonder, huh? Uh, yeah, nigga. Ah, baby. Yeah. Nigga got a little uh, green. Green. What green green safe and Kyle. When Your I first... wife brought him a green aid for Father's Day. He gonna put it, something on the grill. We're, we're, gonna, be, we're gonna be in Miami for Father's Day. Oh, she taking this? Hey, what day is yeah. Father's Day? I've been trying to Nobody never knows. Oh, June 19th. <laughs> June 19th. Oh, man. June Nobody 19th. never knows. My phone don't be ringing on that day, man. What the hell? Mm-hmm. They mamas so, don't like me. Oh, all of this home, huh? You got, you got kids, bro? Yeah, I got two kids. You got two? You play them? Or just on yeah, tax plans? Man, he went and got his kids, bro. He just kicked first. the women out and nah, took the kids. Five, I don't five, 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 five my kids on my place. No, yeah. I don't file tax kids. Yeah, he I don't, file, file, I don't file my kids on my place. Why not? Yeah, business, man. Business, man. You know the woman beat you to the punchline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They keep you out of town. They always come over there and excuse me. I ain't do my taxes. I'm just saying, I ain't do my taxes yet. I'm just trying to see if I can get you. See if it works. Hey, there's some social still good. Huh? There's social now, man. There's mama's pop. Hey, hey, man, get on my kids, B. Hey, that was a whole nother argument in my life. Get on my kids. I ain't do my taxes yet. I'm just trying to see if I can, you know, get two of them. Hey, man, you know you can find like a, you can file a bum or, at, on, at the corner store. You know uh, that, right? That's not a, that nigga ain't got no ID. A homeless person. Ain't cut. A bum or a homeless person. <laughs> She's an air cut. Yeah, y'all going too deep. I refuse to be involved with this <laughs> on the ground. Hey, don't you don't cut. Hey, if he's going to crack, he a bum. Ain't cut. At the gas station. If he's homeless and he smoke crack, he's a bum. Hey, you don't file him. He's a bum. And he don't have to. Don't ask no questions. He's going to get that 1.5 back and then they think you know you see him duck your head, sir. All right, all right. Hey, can y'all scoop that shit up, son? Tight back here. They get to gain a lot of weight with that 1.5, claiming homeless people. And then you can put them in an apartment. He didn't want to go in an apartment. He said he liked his tent. <laughs> it's it's he said tent was, I bought him two tents. Come on, man. I, I bought him a, 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 a double a double deck tent. You can get those little homes from um, Home Depot now. They call them little houses. Yeah. I see why people, you know, two story. Hey man, tell the people where they can find us at. What's the name of our Sorry, uh, man. Oh, uh, Instagram. I gotta get get these guys the back. Dan Podcast. Yeah. Instagram. It's at the underscore Dan Podcast. The D-A or T-H-E-H-E? You know you got to clear that up when you're from New Orleans. Yeah, I heard. D-A is Yeah. Y'all make sure y'all follow them. T-H-E underscore Butler Brand Socks. That's why you put that. Butler Brand Socks. Well, we got a Facebook. They can also be cut, ladies, and they can be gloves. I'm going to bring y'all all the fashion. You can cut this right here, and they can be gloves. You are here. Or oh, they could be the puppy that he stay with me at home. And those his wife told me. Man, go to commercial. Go to that camera. Oh, oop. Thank y'all for tuning in. I thought it was a cold job. I thought it was a cold job. I thought it was a cold job. I thought it was a cold job.